Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for the stylings of Lude! Hey y'all, how you doing today? Obviously he just asked you guys that question, right? But um, I'm a little upset today because uh, I came to the realization that my entire life I've been being lied to. And it's, it's not like those regular lies like Santa Claus is real or the Easter Bunny or anything like that. But um, how many of you guys have ever heard growing up that uh, when you grow up you can be whatever you want? Yeah. Usually people clap, but we're in school, I guess. We raise our hands. Not to be a downer, but I recently found out that that's, that's not true for myself. Because uh, when I was a kid, I didn't want to work at the mall. I didn't want to, you know, um, you know, sell clothes and stuff. What I wanted to do was just be tall. And uh, it doesn't seem like that worked out for me, huh? Thanks for laughing. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? You okay? You need some water? You gotta let it out. Yeah. But, you know, not everything is, is just lies to you when you grow up, except uh, one really weird thing that uh, I've encountered in my life a lot is racism. And I think my friends are slightly racist. And, and only slightly racist, because they are still friends with me, but if... <laughs> if you ask any one of them or accuse them of being racist, their first thing that they would say was like, I'm not racist, I have a black friend. Now the worst part is I think they think that I'm that black friend. <laughs> and, and don't get me wrong, I'd love to be that black friend, but I just, I don't need the qualifications, mostly because I'm not black. Um, I think I could do a really good job in that role, I just don't want to get it because of affirmative action, you know? <laughs> Nah. I love this guy's laugh. It's just like fake, but I can't really tell. <laughs> but uh, yeah, that's like another weird thing though. If you accuse anybody of being racist, like the first thing that their defense is, is no, I've got black friends, which in itself is incredibly racist. But then the response to that is even more racist, like, oh yeah, who? <laughs> Then they go through this long list and you hear more racist things like, hey man, your doorman doesn't count. Which, by the way, I've never really uh, been in a position to have a doorman, but it feels like that's like a prerequisite for racism. It's like if you live in a building with a doorman, you probably should move out just because it's racist. <laughs> yeah, that one needs some work, I'll be honest with you. <laughs> it starts out good and then you just kind of do it, so... Um, but it's, uh, it's great to be here, it's great to see everybody doing this, this local thing, it's, it's really awesome, support local art. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> usually when I do things like this, I follow um, a really deep poet or somebody that has like something important to say, and then I gotta come up here and it's like, nah, nah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but um, it, it's really good to be here tonight, and uh, I noticed that there was a lot of hip-hop playing, uh, before the show started, I love hip hop. I don't know about you guys. You guys love hip hop? <laughs> there is one thing about hip hop that I find very funny. When it when it started out like really old school in like the late seventies, it was really bad. I don't know if you guys have ever listened to old songs, but it was basically just somebody talking about what happened in their day. It's like I got a letter today. It came in the mail. Rain or shine, every day the mail comes without fail. <laughs> it's either that. <laughs> Thanks for the positive reinforcement. I really like that. It's either that or just like nonsense that doesn't really make sense. And um, if you guys think I'm kidding, have you guys ever heard Shibuya Hill Gang's uh, Rapper's Delight? Yeah. Yeah. How does that song start? It's a hip hop, the hip it, the hip it to the hip, hip hop, and you don't stop the hop to the bang, bang, boogie, the up stops the boogie, and the bang with the boogie to beat. Now what you hear is not a test, I'm rapping to the beat. First of all, do I have to remind you guys that I'm making music up here? Like, what's going on? <laughs> It's like, what's this concert gonna start? This dude's just testing the mic. One, two, three, four. We gonna rap some more. Uh, <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, that's pretty much everything that I prepared for tonight. Uh, I hope we have a great show tonight. Uh,